Welcome to my fish room. All right, so Dad's not here. I went and did customers in Oakville after being here this morning, and then I picked up stuff at A Quality on the way home. So Dad asked me to do a video. Didn't get much. Got 12 assorted Africans. These are for, I think it's the Lakeshore Lodge. I think that's where they're going, I don't know. Some assorted Africans. Don't get many fresh water anymore. So. And then 100 rosy reds. You never have too many feeders, especially since, I mean, Dad sells into his customers and I feed some of the fish here then every once in a while. Well, not every once in a while, but I mean, some stuff eats it all the time. And then I got seven royal grandmas. Just the seven. I don't know how he wants me to unbag these and do a video at the same time. Let's see if we can... Camera angles? I don't know if you can see. Keep them in a group. They look really pretty together, but they kill each other. Alrighty, well, short video, but I mean, <laughs> I need to do a tour of the store. This is the ain't okay. So, I have been working here, so I've changed things. That's the Android system. I haven't really done anything to it, but I mean, there's the raceways. We sold the shark today, so it's empty. Some of our corals and stuff, you know, that system needs to be cleaned. This one is going to be a table where um, it's taller than the blue tub, so we'll put a liner in it like we did in the back, and uh, it'll be a table with lots and lots of containers to put individual shrimps and crabs and snails and different inverts. It's easier that way rather than putting them in the tank and having to get lost. This was a brilliant idea. We're s everything's stacked up so you can't find anything. <laughs> It'll make it a lot easier. And then this is the white tub system. This is the angel system. We, we put the angels and like the damsels and stuff because the angels don't as do as well in copper. So we leave them in copper for their three weeks and then we just transfer them over to here. There's other stuff in here too, but then I fixed this up. I took that shelf off that was there with the 12 gallon, put the 12 gallon down there now. Dad took this tank off of that stand and built this one. 
And then this one is going to be like the same like the one over there where I have to build the edges up and then put a pond liner in it and then that'll be the sump for it. Those are dad's experiment tanks. Just let whatever happens happen. Feeders, ghost trim. This is the white tub. Mr. Dog face and some radiatus. Or volatan, sorry. More eel gobies. The snapper's in there. Dad'll never sell him though, so. <laughs> He's not good in an aquarium. We like to put all of the tangs and the bigger fish down here. They seem to do a lot better, so we cleaned that out yesterday or the day before. It was full of all the live rock, which is now in there. So I put everything that was in the bow front tang-wise in here because they like they do a lot better in bigger areas. And there's the purple tang, the giardini, the dolphin fish. Blue tang hiding in the back, lying on its side, but he's hiding. Some uh, yellow gobies and scissor tails in the back. This is the predator tank full of the eels and the blue headed wrasse, the brown bird wrasse, the green bird wrasse. There's the barracuda. Can't really see them. Tangs. The little itty bitty blue tangs. All right, and then in the back, I've done a lot more work as well. Doesn't look much like it, but I've built some stuff. So that's the system that Dad originally built. It's the white tub with the whole, well, with the pond liner. This is what we're gonna do in the on the other systems. And then there's raceway on that side, a raceway on this side. And then I built that, which is going to be like the angel system where we'll use all those bins and I'll drill holes in it. And there'll be a manifold, a manifold up top like that. And then it'll just drain into the bathtubs, which need to get plugged. This is going to be where we're going to grow the mangroves. Built that stand too. And then this big one is another where we have to put a liner in it. And then I have to raise the tanks up a little bit, build another manifold. This one has the white... There's a brown tub over there with a barrel for live rock and then a shelf for bigger tanks in the front. It's coming along. It's messy back here. But already, it's the fish room tour as well as a quality, a small order full of royal grandmas. <laughs>